Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the first ever series of Let's Talk About Doctor Who. I have no idea how long I wanted to do this video. First thing I want to talk to you about is why do I do a series on Doctor Who and nothing else? Doctor Who I grew up with. I grew up watching the show. It means so much to me. I have all of Christopher Eccleston and David Tennant's series on DVD and I must have watched David Tennant over and over again. <laughs> Not only that, I always dreamed that there'd be a female doctor and now there is. Not gonna lie, I did want to be the first female doctor, I mean, why not? <laughs> but, there's obviously a new doctor on the block, Jodie. I'm so happy that they've chosen a female doctor and I think they've casted it very, very well. I feel like she'll be very good. She's worked with David Tennant on Broadchurch, so obviously she can ask him on advice on how to play the Doctor. Because we can't just call the Doctor him anymore. He's an it. Because he isn't just a male. It isn't just a male anymore. It's a bit, it's a female. Like, this is revolutionary. I prove myself as a worthy geek for Doctor Who. I have something to show you. I found this. I believe I got it for my 16th with my friend. But I honestly have no idea. But it's called Web of Fear and I haven't watched it yet. I have no idea what it's about. But it seems quite interesting. So I'm gonna give it a go sometime. But to prove my to prove to you all that I am a big fan. I actually wrote Doctor Who the musical and I actually did it for one of my performing arts exams and let's just say my friends that did the show with me weren't, weren't too pleased as I was the only fan of Doctor Who. Yours truly played the Doctor so in my own mind I was the first ever female Doctor but I'm sure every little girl out there who loved Doctor Who as much as me has always played the Doctor. I know for sure that me and my cousin Daniel used to play in our nan's back garden, Doctor. And I was always Rose and he was always Tennant because that's just, that's just what you do when you're kids, you, you fantasize. Anyway, our, um, our little musical was quite interesting. It had, if I could turn back time, year 3000, time warp it was just a laugh and we came up with silly dance routines and i came up with the funniest characters and i wrote it myself making things even worse for myself but yeah i chose all the music i chose i chose all the words and everything and i'm kind of hoping that i can maybe get some of my friends to do it with me and we'll post it on here as part of this wonderful new series I have created called Let's Talk About Doctor Who and I'm also working on a quirky little theme tune which I think you will all find hilarious because I certainly do because I'm writing it at the moment I'm putting it with a funny track that I found which I think you guys will love but this is basically just an introduction of let's talk about Doctor Who which I'm hoping I can upload quite frequently because I have some awesome Doctor Who props this is just one of many and plus I'm hoping to buy some more so yes I have a screwdriver I also want to talk about all the doctors in general I've been in the same room as many doctors actually um, which you'll know if you watched my Comic Con vlog from like this time last year-ish. I've been in the same room as Colin Baker and Peter Davison and um, let's just say I was starstruck and the family I was with, my dad actually seen Peter Davison walk straight past us 
and for like a full on five minutes I was shouting at him, not being funny yet, yeah, but to buy, I mean, <laughs> it's like, like 25 pounds to buy a pit, to have a picture with Peter Davison. I couldn't afford that. I, like, I bought like ten pound with me to buy a couple of necklaces and badges and stuff. So I was kind of like, okay, but you know, it it worked out. Here's just the proof that I do really care about Doctor Who. I had a photo shoot with my cousin at Comic Con, um, and it was really really cool. But yeah, I just can't wait to see what I can do with this channel. Well, with this series, because the channel's not changing. But because there's no longer a Wii and Wi-Fi and chill, there may be a channel name change. But that doesn't mean that the content's gonna be any different. It will just be my channel. Um, and I've asked the wonderful Corey Gibbons to make me a new channel banner to uh, make things worthwhile the channel change um and yeah i'm very very excited to see where we go next with this <sighs> let's uh let's do this for for david tennant christopher eccleston matt smith peter capaldi and jody oh i'm so excited make sure you stay tuned for brand new content on the series of let's talk about doctor who with yours truly i will also get some of my geeky friends in to talk about doctor who and some people who have no idea what doctor who and then i'll make them maybe watch an episode you know why not right let's do this bye guys make sure you stay tuned like comment subscribe i love you bye